I just wanted to start this video off with telling you guys thank you so much for all the support you've been giving me lately. We started last video or two videos ago with 738 subscribers and now we are at over 780 subs. Thank you so much for you guys who are hitting that subscribe button and hitting that like button. It does mean tons. I am thankful for everything. I try to reply to every single comment so make sure you're participating in the community down below. It does mean a lot to me. Thank you so much for watching this video and let's get right into it. Hey guys, what's going on? We're back and just after the toke nasty hashtag smut is dying and hashtag uh, little Jimmy went viral or went and trended on Twitter, we have apparently received a boost in pack odds from uh, checking out the auction house, from checking out people's tweets, from everything. Uh, it seems to point towards this week might be better. So what we decided to do was go out and get some points and shoot for some of these cards. Maybe pick up Dante Hightower. I don't think I'd pick up Lamar Miller, but I like this Dante Hightower card. And also the 48 hour limited edition card is Odell Beckham Jr. 92 overall with the Playmaker and New York Giants chemistry. This is my first pack opening on this channel and we're gonna see how it goes. 2100 points for our first team of the week bundle. Ooh, team of the week packs, we get three of them. Let's see what we get in this puppy. I've heard, I've seen, I've seen this auction now since it's looking better. It is, it's looking like elites have been being pulled and we would love to get ourselves a Brandon Cook, Bobby Wagner, that's not bad. That's not a bad card to be pulling in the middle of a team of the week pack. It looks like we're gonna get no elites in the first pack. Heading into pack number two. We're gonna get anything. AJ McCarron, that's terrible elite. Justin Houston, there we are already pulling an elite. That's about 30,000 coins-ish. I think he's gotten a little cheaper, actually. Maybe 25,000 coins right there with Justin Houston. Not a bad pull. Still looking for something from the Team of the Week collection. Anything? Okay, we got nothing here. We got nothing. Heading into the third Team of the Week pack, the final one of this bundle. Don't worry, we'll be purchasing another. And right now, looking a little cold. Elite! Eric Kendricks, I love this card. Okay, yes, let's go. Okay, let me check this thing out. 86 speed. That zone coverage, who cares? Because you can user him. Oh, I love Eric Kendricks. He's one of my favorite players in the NFL. Uh, decent block shedding. Uh, loving the speed, though, with this and good hit power. Uh, I probably won't play him, but we'll sell him in order uh, for people to use him in the set. Or maybe we can use him in the set ourselves if we want to go get that Dante Hightower. But these packs have been good to us so far. I am loving that two elites so far loving that loving that loving that let's hit from the back side anything else in the pack okay so nothing else so we got eric kendricks and uh and justin houston through our first three packs and here comes the bundle topper where we get nothing just two regular gold uh, team of the week cards but anyway let's move into the next bundle bundle number two coming in hot looking good after our first one Let's start it off with the Team of the Week packs. Maybe we should have started with the topper, but oh well. We'll just go right into the packs again. And Elite already! Let's go, Jay Ajahi! Yes, this is a good looking card too. This is a very nice looking card. Look at this, 88 speed, 89 excel, 88 elusiveness. This is very similar to that Ezekiel Elliott card out there. Uh, it just looks similar in stats. Ah, another Team of the Week Elite. We're feeling good about these TOTW cards. Pulling Elites all over the place. Maybe the hashtag mutt is dying and hashtag little Jimmy did something. Thank you, Toke. Thank you, Toke. No, I have to go to my binder. Shoot, I'll be back in a sec. All right, I just got done clearing out some space. Let's head right back into these fire packs so far. Ooh, I'm actually happy with how this pack opening has started and we'll see how it's going to finish. We're almost on the home stretch right now of these Team of the Week packs. Barry Cheech Church, don't know how much he's going for. Any elites in this one? Doesn't look like we're gonna have anything. Okay, let's head into pack number three. Give us some luck, give us some luck. An auction item is sold. Maybe that's some luck right there. Give me something. Spencer Ware. Spencer Ware had a good week, actually. Um, but it looks like we're going to get nothing in pack number three of the second bundle. But here we go, straight into the topper. Are we going to get anything? And nothing. But we still have a few more points left, so let's make sure we go and spend some of those. Nothing wrong with buying individual Team of the Week packs. Let's see if we can get any. Derek Johnson starting it off with an elite Team of the Week player. Derek Johnson going for a roughly 25000 right now, maybe a little more. And the card doesn't look that bad. If you guys like his base elite card, you'll love this card, obviously. This card's about two to three better in each 
statistic. All right, nothing else in that pack. We'll go buy one more solo. Heading into pack number eight for the team of the week promotion. Anything in here? Is there anything? Give me a Brandon Cooks. We're through our team of the week cards, and uh, oh, we got three in that one, but we didn't pull anything in there. 6,400 points left, and we're going to head and buy some of these BCA promo packs because, you know what, we've been having a good time with the team of the week. We'll see if we can get anything from the BCA packs. Are we going to get anything? And, you know, pulling these golds is not that bad. We can put them into the elite trade-in, but we'll flip through these awfully quickly for you guys just to see if we can pull any elites. Give us some red paint in here. Anything. We might, we might have to do the reveal all cheese. Might have to cheese them. We're gonna try it. We'll go for the reveal all here. Go for the reveal all. Reveal all. Anything hiding? Anything hiding? Oh, Calais Campbell flashback. Okay, got a nice little collectible there. Calais is uh, is one of the best flashback players out there. So I know all of his. Uh... Oh, oh, I didn't even. I choked there. I choked there. I clicked X twice. Should we go check? Should we go check? Let's go check. Let's see if we got anything there. Ah, oh, shoot. I'm running out of space in my binder too. Looks like we pulled nothing from the pack in between that we didn't see. All right, we cleared a little more space in our binder. Obviously, didn't pull anything from the pack that we missed, but we're gonna head right back into these BCA promo packs, and it looks like these may be just very similar to the odds that we were seeing before. You know, we're not pulling, we're not pulling anything from these, but the team of the week packs were very good to us, very happy with, uh, with the pack odds that we experienced with those, but maybe we can get something here as we wind down through our BCA promo packs. Now this is the first part of the BCA promo that I have uh, that I have invested in or at least tried to buy anything from and right now it's not looking too good. So we'll continue. We'll see if anything pops up. Reveal all cheese. I don't think we got anything. Just more BCA cards all over the place. Not the worst in the world, but Right now, not looking the most promising. Here we come into the topper. Five gold, supposedly, but maybe we can get an elite. I see people getting elites from these. It's not gonna happen to us, of course. Anyway, let's, uh, I've been waiting to do some of these. We'll see if we get anything from the offensive elite upgrade. We are obviously going for that Greg Olson. Maybe a Larry Fitzgerald. Not sure how much those two cards are going for uh, at the current moment, but we'll be able to do two of these right here. Actually, we should be able to do three of these. Okay, so here we go. Going into number one. Anything? Golden Tate's not that great. Okay. Number two. I've seen people pulling Greg Olsen's all over the place. Can we get anything? Nate Soldier. That's terrible. That is horrible. Day of Silver Path. The final upgrade set. We had to go out and buy two more golds for this, but let's see if we get anything from it. We need a Greg Olson. A Greg Olson would be clutch. Give us a Greg. Golden Tate again. That's just disappointing right there. I've seen people pulling. I've seen people pulling Greg Olson all across the board, and then I do it three times to get nothing. And finally, the last part of the pack opening, going for our final team of the week upgrade. What's it gonna be? Please be Brandon Cooks. Ugh. Anyways guys, I just wanted to say thank you for watching this video. It means so much. If you could drop a like if you wanna see more pack openings in the future, we will do that since this pack opening is good. We will re-reward Madden with another pack opening since I, I had a fun time doing this at one. It's you know it's the third one that I've done and uh, the first two didn't go so hot. So I just wanted to say thank you for the hashtag mutt is dying. Uh, trending you know it may have it may have done something about this but anyway i just want to say thank you for watching and hopefully you guys are able to hit that subscribe button or comment down below i'm super appreciative of all you guys i try to reply to every single comment everything that you guys do for me you know this, you guys are the reason i do this uh honestly like i love the community that we're building right now and uh it does mean a lot to me that you guys uh, check out my videos and stay till the end if you're watching this so thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys in the next video